we're going to talk a bit about Zeitgeist and uh, the whole thing in there about the stars, uh, Orion's belt basically pointing to Sirius, pointing to where the sun rises. Uh, and uh, there's people on YouTube who have videos where they use a program called Stellarium and they're basically espousing that Stellarium can disprove what Zeitgeist is saying uh, which I have Stellarium and it is actually backing up what Zeitgeist is saying <laughs> so uh, we're going to go ahead and look at Stellarium and, uh, Get the camera situated, y'all. set our location going to put it about here which is the area the vicinity about where Jesus is supposedly born that's the same vicinity that these so called refuters are using and we're going to have the date and time window set we're going to put it down here uh, and it was going to have the lights off for this. Right. Okay, so we want to put it at, uh, I don't know exactly. I think they said they were doing it like 2,000 years ago about or something like that. So we'll put it at like 1 AD. And we want it to be on December 25th. Trying to watch this in the fucking dark. All right. <laughs> uh, we want to have labels on the constellations. All right, and let's go ahead and look at. Oh no, we don't want 25th. We want on 24th right now. That's right. And then we're gonna look at 5:30. Huh? Oh no, seven long five thirty. <laughs> Seventeen hundred thirty. <laughs> so basically we're looking at uh oops, nope, that's not what I want. Damn it. Fuck you No, fuck it. Stop. The hell. Never did that before. Alright. Wait, I wanted to have the date and time up there. Okay, so we're on December 24th at 5.30 p.m. And stop it. I'm going to try and zoom out here. There we go. Oh, we want to straighten this out. Okay. This here is Sirius. See where the mouse is? That's Sirius. Up here is Orion's belt. See, Orion's belt is pointing down in the vicinity of Sirius. It's, you know, not a perfect alignment. It kind of goes, you know, like, yeah, you know. But when they're talking about alignment, we're talking visually, you know. So it aligns visually, basically. You know, it's, it's pointing towards it. And Sirius is pointing towards this little area over here. Now... If we move forward to uh, 3.30 on December 25th, we find the sun right here in exactly the same area that the uh, 
Sirius and Orion's belt were pointing to the day before. We'll go ahead and go back and look at that again. Oops, that's not what I meant to do. That fucks up everything. <laughs> yeah, see that? Phew. Didn't mean to curve my mouse. Kind of pointing like that. And we'll go again to 3.30 a.m. See that? So, it in fact does point to where the sun rises, just like Zeitgeist was saying. Uh, and also, on the same line, we go over, look at that, there's the Crux constellation. It's right there. Uh, so, uh, you know, as they said, it rises in the vicinity of the Crux constellation. As you can see, it's in like the same area of, you know, along the same strip above the horizon. Hence the, you know, sun on the cross. You know, they, they sh when they do it, the, the visualizations, they show the sun actually on the cross. You know, I think that's probably part of the whole people saying, oh, they're lying. No, they're just trying to make a point with the visualizations. They're telling you everything you need to know you know verbally and they're using the pictures you know to kind of better show you in, in a you know to kind of make their point basically so everything you need to know is you know being spoken verbally the pictures are just making their point 